clouds will burn off very quickly now that the sun is getting higher above the sky and we will enjoy that sunshine throughout the entire day and really it's a great day for us even though the temperatures will be slightly below normal today but rain chances increase in the days ahead and as we head into the weekend most likely we will be talking about rain chances leading all the way through the 500 with that said though it is not going to be a washout we'll time those showers out for you a little bit better as we get closer to the weekend hopefully we can pull them out of the forecast by time we get to Sunday but here are those temperatures I mentioned 46 in Crawfordsville 50 in Columbus 50 in Bedford and Seymour right now for sales are sitting at 48 degrees so as we walk you through the day hour by hour as we head into the noon hour temperatures will be in the low to mid 60s all across the area with skies that'll be mostly sunny so very comfortable if you want to grab lunch outdoors or maybe walk somewhere to grab lunch no issues whatsoever 65 in Columbus about 61 in Muncie and then high temperatures today are actually going to occur fairly late in the day I think it's probably not until five maybe six o'clock that we'll eventually see our high temperatures because you notice by 3 30 we're still only in the upper 60s to low 70s then almost everybody should push into the low 70s here again late in the afternoon and early in the evening if you have any plans tonight the kids have a ball game maybe you have a tea time you will be just fine no issues whatsoever here are those high thin clouds that are out there still they're continuing to break apart and as soon as the sun gets higher in the sky and this area of high pressure builds in we will get rid of those clouds and that's what's going to give us the sunshine throughout the day today now tomorrow morning temperatures will be in the 40s and 50s so just a little bit warmer than they are this morning across the area and tomorrow gets off to a very nice start for us as well with lots of sunshine and then we keep the sunshine throughout most of the day tomorrow it's really not until very late in the day that we'll bring back in the chance of some scattered showers and even the showers tomorrow afternoon and evening they're not going to be all that heavy and I would not cancel any plans because of these showers and you see them come in here throughout the course of the evening hours and how spotty they are in fact by 11 o'clock you probably haven't even seen a drop of rain on the eastern side of Indiana the most shower activity will be in the western portion of the state tomorrow but watch what happens as we head into the day on Wednesday I don't think we ever get into any heavy rainfall throughout the day on Wednesday but you notice the showers they just kind of spin across central Indiana that's a pretty slow moving area of low pressure that's going to be sliding across the state and that's just going to keep us unsettled and so while we're not going to be dealing with heavy rainfall across most of the area late in the day there could be some heavier showers it's just going to be that pesky rain that's going to be off and on it's going to be light it's going to be enough to probably cause some issues on the roadways for your commutes just to give yourself a little bit of an extra hassle uh, to contend with but again no heavy rainfall and temperatures will be in the mid 70s now let's fast forward to race weekend carb day mostly sunny just a very small chance of an isolated thunderstorm at this point for the parade on Saturday we're looking at scattered storms about 79 degrees most of those storms are pretty late in the day and then as we head into race day have showers in the forecast for the morning and what I'm going to be watching for throughout the week is there's a cold front that's going to be coming through late Saturday into Sunday that's probably the wettest period this weekend but the timing at this point is overnight so hopefully those showers are out of here by time we get to the noon hour and that race takes place and of course we'll fine tune that forecast for you as we get closer to the weekend but 73 today and tomorrow Wednesday's the coolest day Lauren with those showers that'll be around with a high of only 65.